All right, ladies and gentlemen, looks like we're back for another exciting stream. It's Friday, y'all. Friday. How's y'all's week been? Y'all had a good week? Good week? Y'all should have. Everybody should always have a good week. Every day, good day. Every week, good week. Every weekend, good weekend. It's all about mindset. EA Sports. <laughs> it's in the game. All right, cool. Let's let's jump right on here. Hold on. Uh. So I do need to let y'all know. Uh, I looked ahead a little bit. To uh, don't give me that look. You know what's up. Uh, I looked ahead a little bit to see how long I can hold off on going to talk to Gortash. And. Apparently, the unanimous thing is, uh, just go ahead and go deal with him. Go talk to him. I went back and reloaded an old save and bounced around a little bit, looking at different things, but I didn't go too far, as you can tell by the time. Uh, right here. If I'm gonna load up this save right here, where we last left off. Go over there. <laughs> so, uh, the general consensus is, if I push Gortesh off and do anything else, it glitches out the whole goddamn third act story ending shit, so. I'm gonna go back and talk to Gortosh. Gortesh, Gortosh, whatever. Uh, really ugly guy. Bruh. Hold on, I gotta set this up. There, go. Alright, this is where we are. Got here. Go back. Go talk to Gortash. Gotta go back up to Worms Crossing. Take forever to load. I'm trying to see where all this stuff is at. If we come across any of this, over there was the shadow ends, the tower. All right. Does my feet can carry me? Head back in here. Where was that one that was yelling at me to go in? Was it? I think it was this one. Was it? Oh, it was this one. There we go. Uh -oh. I I know that's that's my plan. Ugh. Lord Gortash is expecting you. Please make your way to the audience chamber. Can I can I talk to these people first though? Look, I'm all for Gortash, but those clankers. They don't sit right with me. Because they do your job better than you and without complaining. It is unnerving. Imagine where we'd be without them. The city would be overrun. They're all that's keeping this cult at bay. He has a point. They make people feel safe, if nothing else. Ha! You hear this? Tell my friends how safe you feel with those metal giants stamping about. I couldn't feel safer. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> Have you seen how big they are? You shouldn't trust them. They'll turn on you eventually. I've seen the absolute uh, army. Nowhere safe. Still watch or not. Uh, they'll turn on all of you eventually. You've been reading too many picture books. Lord Gortash himself is the one pulling their strings. We're all better off for it. Mm, he's got them all blindly eating out of his hand. Oh lord, okay. Let's see. Let's go talk to these folks over here first. Who's this? Seems like a good moment to talk. Cult army on the march, killer on the loose, and Mistress Dorenbold still drags me hither and thither. Oh, you make it sound like it's a terrible thing. Are you hear? My lady says Absolute's army's on the march. There's watchers. 
We'll hold the line. You best believe. Who is this? Waiter! Sorry, sorry, these jukes are working me to the bone. Oh. Who are you down here? Lord Porter is Potter God. Head up, chest out. Lord Portier could descend any moment. Bro, I thought that dude had an arrow sticking out of his head. Was it? Some decorum. This is, a is that a part occasion. of his bow? Oh. Sir, your neck. Your neck seems to be growing an arrow. Lord, Archduke, God. <laughs> I'll call Gortash what he wants. As long as Lord Chatshield pays me for all this waiting around. Yeah. You don't need it. Hush. Patriots are upstairs. Lord Janeth could call for me at any moment. Oh. Bollocks. Fuck off. Hey, it's a cook. Bruff's babbling. No time to talk. I was a waiter. Hold on. Oh, I'm sure. He can wait. He waited this long. He can wait more. Hold on. Where's... Is this guy the only one I haven't talked to? It is. Alright. You, sir, you look important. What do you have? Master Porter, I've taken the liberty of... Oh, you're not the master. Just as well. I, I mean, I could be. We're right, Bryce. What was down here? That's a hidden door. If I ever did see one, that is a hidden door. And it leads outside? Ah! Oh, there's a hidden way to get around here. Okay, cool. And that would lead back over there. I could climb down this rock. Head over here. And head down there where that boat is. I don't know. There's more stuff over there. There's a place to go over here. Okay. Let me let me get back out here. Lord Gortash is expecting you. Okay, fine, fine. We're going upstairs. Oh shit. Okay. Uh. Oh, this looks official. What? What's what? Oh, there's Gortash right there. What the hell is that? Is that the? Oh, it's the Duke. Oh, that's the uh, the one guy that got a parasite with his eye in Act Two. Hmm. Here, moves. Quick save again. All right, let's go. I guess we're going all the way up here. Kings, people, Baldurians, and dearest Duke Ravengard, thank you for joining me on this exceptional day. It's him. Gortash. <sighs> this is it. I can practically taste his blood from no, here. No, calm down. Can I have it right the here? The is letting her passions get the better of her. The situation is delicate. Do not be swept up in her emotions. I mean, true. I mean, there's a fuck ton of people here. You don't need to tell me that. Hmm. I couldn't stand still. I couldn't stand to see the steel watch and get their hands on you. Let's wait for a more opportune moment. We'll leave the charge, Carl. At Cortash dice said, Oh, nope. Let's go. I don't want to put you in harm's way either. I'll wait for now. But that prick is going to pay. A moment, please, my friends. An old acquaintance has come to pay her respects. Please, Carl act. Come and say a proper hello. My respects! You're lucky I've agreed not to shove my boot up you! Ah, how I've missed your colourful turns of phrase. We must catch up just as soon as I've had words with your little friend. Oh? What words might as that you, be? I understand congratulations are in order. Thorm's defeat hasn't gone unnoticed. You're known for who you are and for that nether stone that you carry. 
Good God, his face. Hold on. What? Why is it doing this? The, the hicks are a clear warning. If nobody steps in soon, it'll free itself from the authority of the crown. I expect it'll start with turning the sword coasts infected. You among them. A prism of yours won't last indefinitely. Next, the grand design. The Mind Flayer Empire reborn. If we're lucky, we'll become slaves. If we're unlucky, well, not the most thrilling of prospects, but it's a fate that can be avoided if you and I come to an understanding. Together, we can still restore authority over the brain. This guy is ugly as shit. Of course. Gortash always did have an eye for opportunity. Hmm. Kind of understanding that you suggest. If not interested in bargaining with the likes of you, I'm not interested in bargaining with the likes of you. Why is the crown failing? Uh, you're dead, man. I can't let you take over the city. Uh, why is the crown failing? It's not. But it will not follow new orders unless the Netherstones are united to give the command. Hmm. When it finishes executing its current orders, it will be free to do as it wishes. That will be bad for everyone. Once it is freed from its shackles, I doubt we'll ever be able to bring it under control again. <laughs> Weedor gang? What? What the, what the hell is that? We can talk about a Weenor. What's a Weenor? Hold on. Do I have to Google this? I feel uh, so, uh, so out of it. All you kids and your new terminology. No, no, it's a Weenor. Okay, I see what you're saying. All right. <laughs> I thought it was a, a euphemism or something. Well, technically, it is a euphemism. But uh, are are we are we touching tips with our Weenors, or how are we doing this? Is it real Weenors? We using hot dogs? I could go for a hot dog right now. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. So he, he wants an understanding. Uh. <laughs> so, Glizzy Boys. Yeah, Glizzy Boys. There we go. Mm -mm -mm. Ah, what kind of understanding do you suggest? There's an old wisdom. A brittle alliance can never be mended, it can only break. With Catherick yeah. gone, Orin proved treacherous. Baal's Chosen wants the Netherstones for herself. She only cares for blood. And your blood and mine are of particular interest to her. Um... What are you getting at? Orin changes shape faster than you and I change clothes. You know, she's tricked you before. She's targeted me as well. I'm well protected, but she's extremely good at what she does. If Orin obtains all three netherstones, she'll plunge the coast into chaos and paint the city in blood. I can't let that happen. I want to lead this city to glory, not scorch its earth. Hmm, it's gonna take a lot to make me trust you. I'd like to propose a pact. A divine oath sworn upon spirit and flesh. I do no harm to you, nor you to me. Furthermore, you'll have nothing to fear from my steel watch while our pact stands. Eh, my Thor's guy. stone is yours to keep. When you slay Orin and take her stone, you bring it here. So the three are united once again. Together we rule Faerun as kings. No, more than kings. Gods. We rule as the absolute. What do you say? Shall we be allies? I this can't no know deceit. This alliance could serve us well. God damn it, Emperor. Get the and fuck out of my head. It does not. Well, we need not honor it. Yeah, true, but I don't want to be in alliance with him anyways. Let's be allies, said the viper to the frog. Good job, Carlac. You remember that uh you remember that little story. 
detect thoughts. Let's detect those thoughts. What do you got? DC 13, uh, 4 to 9. Add the bonus, 5 to 13. So the minimum I can roll getting all ones would be. Fuck. 8. That's pretty good odds. I've got an inspiration just in case. 8! That's the absolute minimum I needed to roll. But I got higher than that with the mother rolls. Ah. <laughs> that was just luck. Pure fucking luck. Orin is unreliable. This one. This one shows promise. She keeps her word. I keep mine. We will rule as one. As allies, it seems none of you can be trusted. You, Orin, Catherick. So Kethrick was ready to betray our alliance too. Yep. I can't say it comes as a surprise. But you should know this. I initiated this plot. I brought Kethrick and Orin together to create the Absolute. They knew this would only work if we stood united and coordinated our powers. Their ambition blinded them to reason. I don't suffer the same affliction. In short, you can trust me. Anybody who says that you can trust me, I immediately do not trust. Uh I will defeat Orin and we shall be allies. You have my oath. Uh no. Um to the hell with your pack. Uh no he'll outright kill me here. Um I'll think about it. No promises. Perhaps a demonstration of why you need my help will motivate you to make the right decision. Your camp is compromised. One among you is an imposter, a faceless. Who, I can't say. I'd suggest a thorough investigation. You'll find I speak the truth. A doppelganger in our camp. That sounds all too believable. The faceless in your camp is like a knife at your throat. Remove it quickly. Or any alliance between us would be exceedingly short-lived. How am I supposed to find Orin if she could change her form easily? Yeah, you, Orin, Kethrick, the brain, what was your plan? That's a good question. What was your plan? First, Orin the Red, bloody dagger of Baal, causes panic in the streets through killings in the Absolute's name. Go on. Next, the threat of the Absolute's monstrous armies formed by Merkel's general, Kethrick Thor. In such circumstances, People crave strong leaders. Oh, that leaders explains that bring it. Leaders law, order, and protection. Leaders like me, Bane's unyielding hand, author of justice. You are soon to witness the people of Baldur's Gate granting me complete power over them, all out of fear of the absolute. Next, I, we, will declare curfew and begin infecting the masses. Our subjects will hear the voice of their absolute god. The faithful will do anything in the name of their god. And so begins your tyranny. Our tyranny. And we are saviors. Defenders of the Sword Coast. Our loyal subjects will love us, not hate us. What comes next will be entirely their fault. So, to let you know, chat, my plan is to usurp Gortash and I become the tyrant. That's my plan. So, I'm just going to shit talk him and then take it from him eventually at some point. I'll just take his gem. And him and Orin's as well. And then I will control the Elder Brain. That's my plan. I don't know how that's going to turn out, but that's my plan. Nine Hales, did you find a powerful artifact like the crown? Powerful connections. Let's leave it at that. You made deals with devils is the only thing I could think of. Hmm. Free to go. I've heard enough. Am I free to go? Soon. First, come and be witness as I make history. The first Archduke of Baldur's Gate. Cool. Oh, yeah, I don't have the bot command set up for Lurk. I don't even know how to set that up. I gotta figure out how to set that up. Uh, I'm pretty sure stream elements I could just put up the deal, but I appreciate the alert though. I appreciate it. So, gotcha.
Mm, no interest in this sham of a ceremony. Then allow me to peek it for you. Your brain twists and stretches under the watcher's gaze. The pain almost brings you to your knees before fading. You will follow me, and you will show due respect. Distinguished dukes, patriarchs, dearest Raven Guard, I will heed your call. A new chapter begins. Hmm. Enver Gortash, swearest thou by Baldurin's blade to defend the citizens of Baldur's Gate from enemies within and without? I swear. Insight. A roll insight check. It's clearly a lie. Well, to be fair, swearest he's got everything set up where he doesn't have to lie. To the same by word, deed, and decree. So that none may suffer? I swear. <clears throat> Gathered guests, grant ye consent? Oh, God. Say nothing. Enver Gortash, the council appoints you Archduke of Baldur's Gate. My friends, the Steel Watch stands ready. Let its blade fall on any who would diminish our city. And you, honored guest, will find me in my office above when you return. Do not come empty-handed. Hmm. All right, who wants to talk to me over here? Who is this? Karlak. Okay. So there you have it. Lord Enver Gortash, in all his glory. What did you make of him? Seemed like an absolute fraud in a very nice coat. Frankly, I'm impressed. He's wormed his way into the most powerful position in Baldur's Gate. As someone who would do the same, I am impressed. I can't wait to flatten him. He only managed it by tadpoling Duke Ravenguard. Meh. Gortash doesn't play fair. Details. He wouldn't have been able to skip to the top like this. Details. I don't know how anyone in this hall could fall for this charade. Isn't it obvious what a chancer he is? Hmm. People are most people are mostly fools, and people are scared they'll do whatever it takes to feel safe. And they expect these big metal monsters to tuck them in at night while the absolute knocks on the gates. If only they knew the truth. The Dead Three orchestrated all of this, and it's working. Yep. I wish this city, the people running it, were smarter than me. Gortash isn't their salvation. He's the monster at the gate. Oh yeah, you're speaking to the choir, Carlac. I know. Wait, how is everybody's reputation with me? Oh wait, no. Uh, I. Let's get on with it. So, she is very approving of me. Carlac, she's way up there as well. I can't see the numbers. What's the numbers on it? Uh, that must be done with a mod. It's exceptional. Character is thrilled with it and very easily convinced by Avatar. Okay. Well, hello. Necerion. Trust in character. Avatar is variable. Now, hmm. He could have murdered me at any point, but he has not. Why? Hmm. Oh well. Okay, there's that. What is all up here? Is that an elevator? No, it just leads outside. Here's a fire barrel. Fire! Yeah, what happened there? All right, what's out here? Nothing. What's in here? 
Nothing? Maybe? Hold on. Can I go out? Nope, I can't. They're gonna be like, no, that's there is restricted. You can't go there. Where can I go? Hold on. I can't go there because that's off limits. That's off limits. Nonsense. Nonsense. If the walls are breached. Hmm. Wait, who all is up here I can talk to? Oh, these are all, like, rich people. Terrier. Terrier. Yeah. I ain't fetching you shit. Woman. Haul it. Rugger Shatter Shield, Thirnbold, Ruth Lenisek. Yeah, let's talk to the other leaders. Wait, no, do not talk to them. Switch. There, talk to them. An Archduke! Finally, someone who can stand up to those wretched absolutists. He is an absolutist, but the- What glory, our city. And what glory, its future. Hmm. Archduke Gortash, man of the people. The right people. The hell is that supposed to mean? Ravenguard has not once failed this city. If he trusts Gortash, then so do I. I see. The Steel Watch has made an impenetrable fortress out of the Sword Coast Crown Jewel. I can't think of a better endorsement for Gortash than that. Hmm. Interesting. What is this book? The Tires Journal. Uh, I can't go there. I can't sit on the throne. Ugh. Whatever. I'm going down. It's not over. Then through. Yeah. Now yeah, we're going down, down. Sugar, we're going down swinging. Got another one with a bullet. With a loaded gun complex, cocking and bullet. Wham. Can I go to this side? Is this not off limits? Oh, I don't want to confront him yet. Hold on. I'm just curious and trying to loot. What are you doing? Fist over here? Rainish. What? Oh, uh, what are you? What are you doing in here? You're not a fist. Go on, get out, or I'll, I'll wake the others. Detect thoughts. Wake the others, or what? Hmm. They haven't put up the prices again. That ferry's my last chance out of here. But she's got to have something that'll cover the rest of my fare. Mm, go ahead. I'll tell them that you're finding a ferry ticket with their stolen belongings. How do you know about that? Did those crooks down the dock send you? I told them I'll get the money in time. Not my fault they're charging triple. Take your money, my ass. A thief a thief. I don't care who or why you're doing it. I know I'm such a hypocrite. <laughs> I don't care. So you're a deserter then. Um, They've got a point. These are dangerous times to be traveling. What's got them so spooked? What's got them so spooked? You haven't heard. An army is coming. Oh, Lord. They're saying it's unstoppable. 
My wife said we have to stand and fight, and... And I can't. I won't. I'm not made for this. So you're a coward. You seem capable from where I'm standing. Get a grip. You're a soldier. Act like one. I've heard enough. Gods, I've spotted the thief. Intimidation. Hand over everything you stole, and I'll let you live long enough to run. Yep. Ooh, that's 15 to 23. Easy is 15. Oh, wow. As long as I don't roll a 1, I'm, I can I'll succeed. Oh, there we go. Done. All right, all right. It's all hidden up on the roof. I just wanted to be safe. I'm not a coward. I'm not. <sighs> Manit Bakshi, Oriana, there. All right, let's carry on. Pick this lock. What are you doing? Go over here. Stop. Stop. I'm, I'm robbing them all blind. Here we go. 28. Nice. You literally had nothing. Hold on. <laughs> oh, that's cheeky. They left him a stuffed bear in a note. Time to press ahead. Let's see what they all have. Hold on. What is it? Come here. Walk pick this one. With ease. There you go. Now there's that 134. Clock pick. 33. Lock pick. I failed? How do I fail? Yeah, try again. There you go. 32. That's more like it. Lock pick. Eight. How do I fail again? Jesus. Yeah, try again. 30, 20. Okay. What to do? Carlac, or Shadowheart, I need you to crouch. Okay, yeah, sure. Take that. Take that. Open. Take all that. That open. Take all that. Okay, cool. Should mind my step. Have to keep going. Got a drain trap. All right, cool. And what's over here behind door Let's number three? Wait, what did she say? What was she going on about? Huh. Interesting. That takes a passageway down. Over here. Who is this up here? This Brocco. Hmm. I'll come back later. Now what is down here? Interesting. Very, very, yes, very, very fascinating. Fascinating stuff everywhere. Fascinating. Hmm. 
Oh, that's right. She wanted me to bring Will. I'm not bringing Will. I don't like Will. I should speak up. Well, not the personal. I just don't like it. Whatever. What did I tell you? A momentous occasion. I'm sure you agree. And to think the drama's just started. You see, Gortash has had Will's father relocated. Hmm. That was fast. I thought Gortash would have more use of the Duke in Worm's Crest. Relocate it. What are you playing at, devil? Rude. This is Gortash's game. I'm just an impartial observer. Raven guards good as dead. And to think there's no way to save him. Or is there? You know something, don't you? I'm not going to give up on the Duke. Tell me what to do. Who knows? Let him die. For all I care. You know something, don't I you? Know enough. Let's talk to Will in your camp. Work something out. Okay. The Duke's life depends on it. Okay. Hmm. All right, let's see here. Take a look at the journal. What do I need? Rescue the Archduke. Duke. Yeah, oh, I gotta figure out who the imposter is. I need to take a long rest. Uh, I've had this buff right here, though. Hmm, it's so good. Should I go back and talk to that prostitute to get it again? Hmm. I still have a short rest. Fine, let's go back to camp. I gotta figure out who the imposter is anyways. Let's be Yenna. Or the fucking fox. I brought my own paring knife. Now I just need some ingredients. And I'm gonna make something really good. I promise. So who did she replace? I had no wish to lose Will, but my, it would have been nice to flush her into the colony's flesh pit. <sighs> tell me what, tell her what happened to the Harper safe house. It seems that events at Denthalans have overtaken us. My contact there just sent word. The Harpers have been fractured, infiltrated by doppelgangers. Perhaps we might have done something to help. Or just fallen into the trap along with them. Oh, I only have myself to blame. I have not been overly generous with the truth. I came here to learn of the Chosen, true enough. But I set my heart for searching for someone else, too. Tell me, what do you know of a man named Minx of Rashomon? Minx? <gasps> as familiar as Jahira's own. A hero of the time of troubles, who saved the city more than once. Chabon! Hey! Nice of you to join me here today. I'm glad to see you came along. So, uh, yeah. Apparently, they're bringing up Minx. Minx and his, uh, his giant space hamster, Boo. Mm, he traveled with you back in the old days. <laughs> there is a ball. They're in alive. He doesn't know that name. Yeah. The best boy. Yep. I traveled with you back in the old days. I sense you mean no insult, calling scarce a century ago the old days, which is considerably more insulting. Minsk is an old friend, perhaps my oldest. We fought at one another's backs, times beyond counting. And the last time I saw him, I left him to die. You did. I forgot about that. Uh, I don't remember the details, but yeah. I suspect there's more to the story than that. There always is. But that is still the fundamental fact of it. Before we ever heard of this absolute, 
we received word of a gathering in the Undercity. What we found was the first dark seed of this plot. A circle of cultists with mind flares in their midst. We might have ended it there, cut off at the root, but before I could send for help, Minsk charged in alone. It was chaos. He was overrun, dragged down beneath a mass of tentacles. I had a choice. Stay and let word of this cult die with us, or leave him and live to fight another day. So you left him. Sounds like he's got what he deserved. No, I'm sorry to hear him. That's a cruel choice to have to make. And here you are. You made the right choice. Don't second guess yourself. Yep, there the you go. The world takes much from those who presume to defend it. But sometimes, you get to take it back. So don't be sorry. Because I mean to use you. If you're willing. Huh. Infection. Indoctrination. Eradication. That has been the fate of everyone the cult has captured so far. But it has not been yours. With your help, perhaps it need not be Minsk's either. Hmm. Why are you only telling me this now? We could try, Jahira. But we don't even know if he's still alive. Excuse me. Why are you telling me this now? Because I was playing the pragmatist. And writing my friend off for dead? Then I met you. If I seem suddenly flushed with hope and soft feeling, you have only yourself to blame. Oh, the point is moot without a means to find him. Without the Harpers, we shall have to find another path. I'll have a better idea of what that is once we're through the gates. Seems I need to reacquaint myself with this damned city. Okay, um, M. The hell? This is the camp. I can't even go up there. Hold on. Wait, who's been kidnapped? Who's the doppelganger? Wait, Shadow Horror can read? Come to bask in the glow of the Moon Maiden's sword? Be most welcome. I wish I could play an ASMR. Alright, leave. Hold on. Alright, we always wanting to talk about Missouri. Yada, yada, yada. Your tadpole quivers, revealing your discussion with Missouri to Will. Shit. Father's been taken, and Mazora started to scheme. By all the hounds of the hells, what is she planning? Mazora's up to nothing good, but that's for certain. I have no idea. But I can't wait to find out tomorrow night if we're lucky. Your father's involved, which means it's worth hearing her out. Uh, where's Cortez taking your father, do you think? You don't have a single clue. Uh, she's your patron, not mine. Uh... What do you think they're taking your father? I couldn't even fathom a guess. Though, I doubt we'll need to wait long for answers. We'll have answers soon enough. Let's talk to Mazora. Until then, may my father keep safe. Whatever coop he's been flown to. Hmm. Grand Duke Stelmane's been murdered. Do you know her well? Did you know her well? I met her twice. The first time, I was a boy of seven or eight at a banquet in the flaming fist's honor one look and i was smitten chestnut hair that flowed behind her like willow fronds as she floated from one room to the next as if carried by clouds the second time stelmane was different even with the aid of a cane each step she took was a struggle every word she spoke took great physical effort a stroke victim I asked father later. No, he said. A stroke survivor. You sense uncertainty in Will's voice. He questions his father's explanation. 
I sense there's something more to the story. Mm. I shall persuade you to tell me with my high skills. That's a 26. Oh, that's low. Mm, something's always gnawed at me. At the banquet, Stelmay didn't seem to look at us, but through us. But that second time, her gaze never left me. It was steel, sharp and unyielding. It could just be my imagination, but I always felt that it was more than a stroke that had changed her. What, though? I couldn't say. Hmm. Sounds like, what a tragedy. If Stelmane was suffering, maybe death was a blessing. Hmm. Nonsense. Stelmane was no less worthy of life or success because she was disabled. I didn't say Her that. death is no blessing. It is a calculated cruelty. Think about it. My father was Tadpole. Stelmane is dead. The people are frightened and the council's in disarray. Oh yeah, to I kind of get control, that. You must first sow chaos. A tyrant strategy, as father would say. These murders aren't random acts. Someone powerful is guiding the killer's hand. And the city is made weaker for it. Hmm. Inconceivable that we would seek release from one tadpole only for you to commune with another. I chide you if my mind were not consumed by the sight of Orpheus within his domed prison. The Prince of the Comet lives, but make no mistake. I can see the change in you, feel the parasite worming its way through you even further. You have invited your own misery. I will not break our alliance for it, but I will not condone it. Good. Because nobody fucking asked you. Voss has gone underground. He'll be waiting for us there. This Orphic hammer could be a way to release Orpheus from his prison. Mm. Alright, hold on. Let me... Leave, because... I don't know if I'm talking. Hold on. Rest at the camp and gather your allies. Clarify ally when we need it most. Hmm. It's able to watch, consider Gortash's bargain. Destroy the elder brain, control the other brain. Haha, <laughs> I love Lazale. I can't stand her. Uh, she's slowly changing on me though, once you got away from her fanatic, like heretic ways of fallen of Blacketh. Yeah, no. Once I showed her the evidence that Blacketh was a liar and a murderer of her people, she was like, oh, okay, I guess. Hi, Harper. Fine, Minx. Grand Duke. Meet her in camp. Okay. Lookout called Frag Drogar. Now he revealed that the cloister is hidden in a place called the House of Greeks in a lower city. Okay. Okay. How do I find the one that's... Hmm. So I talked to you here. I talked to Will. I'm afraid to talk to Lazel. Because I don't want to... Tilt my hand more than what it could be. Wait. Withers would know. I wonder if Withers could give me any insight to who's the doppelganger Fate is. Fate spins along. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection? Where's Arabella gone? The girl has left to hew her own path. She left you a letter. Thou couldst read it, or thou couldst not. 
such is the way of autonomy. Hast thou other business? I want the red letter. Yeah, give me the nope, I. Where's the letter? Here it is. Hmm, still fresh and letters drawn in the careful ham. Hey you. So are you a lot. For why? I don't know what the inside of a snake's belly looks like. For another, you let me stay at your camp. And for another, for another another, you found out what happened to my moms and pops. I'm on my own now, and Bone Man says it's a good thing. I just have to leave the weave. Let, just have to let the weave guide me. Oh, words. And as far as I can tell, it's tugging me to Baldur's Gate, so I'm headed there first. Anyway, thanks for everything. I won't forget it. Arabella. Hmm. Gather your allies. Okay. Words, 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 words. Alright, cool. Hey, the owlbear got bigger. Where's the silica? It says the silica. Let me talk to Gail. Whatever business Will has with Mazora, it will cost him dearly. Or worse still, it will cost us. I hope we can afford it. <sighs> hmm. No. Words are hard, it's fine. It's okay, it is confusing. When I first met you, saving yourself from seromorphosis was your greatest wish. And yet now, you've stepped closer to embracing it. I trust your leadership and respect your decisions, but I truly hope this is not something we come to regret. Have you heard from Daniel since we moved on? I have. He speaks to me during my nightly meditations. He is well. And Oliver also. At times they are one, and at others they divide. Easier for playing, perhaps. And the land thrives also. I doubt you would recognize it. Perhaps one day, you and I can both return and see it for ourselves. Yep, leave. All right, who's a doppelganger? Is it Isabel? Keeping very well, I hope. What will you do now that? Oh wait, no, I've asked her that before. Never mind. She's gonna be free with the woman of her love. Okay. I have a sinky suspicious it is Lazel though. That's the doppelganger. The devil will come for her due. Miss whatever it is she comes to offer, whatever choice Will makes, someone will suffer. Count on it. Hmm. Boss has gone under that underground. We'll be he'll be waiting for us there. Voss has done his duty. Now we will do ours. We must find our way to the House of Hope and take the. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 Your Honor, innocent until proven guilty. No, 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 no. That's actually not how the justice free. assistance works. Uh, you're detained until proven innocent. That's how the justice system works. Uh, you know what? I hold off on all that. I'm. I'm gonna go rest. Wait, where are the beds? That's a damn good question. Where are the beds? Wait, is it over here? Wait, how do I go to bed? Oh, we're sleeping on hay bales. I guess it's better than sleeping on the ground. Okay. Uh, quick save in case it's some bullshit I don't want to deal with. And then we're going to end day. Come on, run all the way over here and click the thing. There. Go to sleep. Yes.
my testament. No tomb sit in Beator. No tomb sit in Beator. She's forming a new pact. You've heard of such devils, sisters of justice, adjudicators of diabolical contracts and bargains. Holy hells. Interesting. I don't recall sending it out invitations to the Sisters of Justice. You do not call upon the Sisters. They come when the Hells demand witness. Your parasite links with Wills, and your memories flow into him. He sees his father's flight from Worm's Rock, and hears Mizora's words to you. Shit. Where did Gortash send my father? How do I save him? Sisters. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. Infernos contractos te vocamos. The vocal infernal contract is what it comes down to. No will. Your contract, Will. Signed in blood. Forged in fire, bound in bone, but not unbreakable. Wait, I've already broke his contract. She said there was a six month clause in there before she could do it. That was the whole reason why I freed her. What the hell? What are you proposing? A life for a life. No contract is ended without sacrifice. The cost must be paid. That's bullshit. That's bullshit devil lies. You don't need to do that. Will Ravenguard, a choice is before you. Option one, I show you the way to your father. I guarantee him no harm except that from you and your allies. And you... Pledge your soul to me and the Archdevil Zariel in a pact eternal. Option two. I break your pact and you are freed from your duty. Your father dies by his enemy's hand and Baldur's Gate loses its greatest champion. Name your sacrifice. Bloody Zariel. I won't let her take will. Silence, Karlak. Mizora, you asshole. Choose. The city would need him to help rebuild. Do the right thing. Give your soul so that your father can live. Break the pack, Will. You deserve your freedom. Father, die. What will happen to Will's powers if he breaks the pact? Addendum F. The Absolute must be avenged for the Soulbinder's detention at Moonrise. The Soulbearer retains his gifts until such time as the Absolute is slain. Break the back, Will. You deserve your freedom. You damned wretch! Father... Do it. Break the pact. Fiat Ita. Fiat Ita. Oh. Anima ad beator. Why did you have to call upon an Italian car? That's that's barely functional. I think you had it in you. <laughs> Seems my boy's all grown up. And don't go fussing about your father. You made your choice. You knew the terms. Eh, don't look at you me. That tone of voice. I think I'll stick <laughs> around. Not for the greater good, you understand. Just for the entertainment. Achievement. Loophole. I broke Will from his contract. However, I already... I believe I know how to solve his, his, his father's whereabouts. We can find that out later. They haven't killed him out, but I... Because Gortash would be an idiot to kill the Duke of Ravenguard. Because Ravenguard is a very powerful, influential person. 
and it's by his endorsement that he became the Archduke. So if Gortash kills Ravenguard, then he shot himself in the foot because he killed his number one supporter that's gathered up all the other nobles. So yeah, Mazora thinks she's funny. But she's not. Alright, cool. Was there anybody I need to talk to? What is Mazora? Leave the poor guy alone. Okay, let me go talk to fucking Will. Mazora's being a cunt. At least he got out of it earlier. Look at his flashy horns, though. God, I spent seven years choked by Mazora's leash, and I spent the seven panda. years hoping to break free. The panda. I never what knew panda? freedom could taste so bitter. I'm confused. The kung fu panda. What panda? Fiat panda. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot they made a panda. <laughs> Wasn't it like one of their only Japanese models? That's funny though. I love it. Uh, hold on. It's a little late from remorse, don't you think? Uh, you are your own man now, Will. It's better this way. A fantastic power way. Power play. With your father gone, you can rise up and take his place. <laughs> what? I thought you never regretted taking the pack. Yeah, let's call him out on that. I thought you never regretted taking the pack. I didn't. I don't. My sacrifice kept Baldur's Gate safe from Tiamat's rage. But that doesn't mean that the leash never chafed. That I was content to lap up oh. whatever nonsense Mizora fed me. The leash has been broken, and my father left for we dead. We got Panda, 4x4. Four four. Yeah. Tomorrow I celebrate <laughs> my game. I can't believe I forgot about that. My bad. But today, <laughs> I mourn my loss. A moment passes. In the stillness, you find a moat of tranquility. The Raven God name now lives solely with me. I will make it count for something. That's right. Usurp your father. I mean... You take command. Hmm. Your father's not dead yet, Will. Maybe there's a way to save him. I signed his life away before the Hell's Witnesses. That's... It would be easier to drink the sticks down That's not the what was said, you idiot. His fate. I'd be a fool to wish otherwise. God, no wonder you ended up in the contract with her. You're so damn gullible. Uh, what's our next step then? We obtain the final two nether stones and take back our minds and the city from the brain. Okay, well, leave. I'm not talking about anything else. He's an idiot. God. Little Will's all grown up. I can't wait to see what trouble he gets into. You force Will to make an impossible choice. Will's not a child. You need to start treating him with respect. Actually sacrifice his father to save himself. <laughs> That's it then, Duke Ravengard said. He's not dead. <clears throat> you force Will's not a child. You need to start treating him with respect. I beg your forgiveness for such undue impertinence. From now on, I promise him the same measure of respect he's shown his father. Oh, I almost forgot. Will sold his father's life for his freedom. <laughs> My mistake. I don't get out. If Will is in your walk, why stick around and give him power? You left Carlac alone. You didn't want her. You didn't want her dead? What changed? What can you tell me about the hells? Uh, you never told me about the absolutionist captured you. I want you out of here now. I want to be straight. I need something in return. Hmm. Love Carla alone. You didn't want her dead? What changed? Oh, you are an inquisitive one. I'd have thought you'd figured by now. Zariel found a new use for an old battle axe. 
The dead three in that bulging brain of theirs are a threat to more than this trifling city, you know. Savor her company. Who's to say when Zariel might change her mind? My mistress can be so capricious. Um, well, in that case, you never told me how the evolutionist captured you. Correct. I didn't. If you must know, I was scouting the cultists on behalf of Zariel, but those cursed shadows were thick enough to fell even a half-fiend. I woke in that damned pod. It kept my body sealed and my most powerful magic silenced. But a brave kind, benevolent soul set me free. Gallantry isn't dead after all. You don't have a pact now, do you? Tuttle heart. I need you to cast planar binding. We will kill this right where she stands. Hmm. Hmm. If you're going to be staying... Wait, hold on. If you're going to be staying, I need something in return. I'm supplying Will with every scrap of his infernal power. I've paid my dues many times over. Oh, uh, his I role is actually what, redundant. I don't need him. When the time comes to squish that big baddie of a brain, I'll lend you a hand. What can you tell me about the hells, then? The nine hells of Beator. Each its own domain, each with its own archdevil to rule it. I call the first hell my home, Avernus, my mistress Zariel's realm, a torrid battleground split by the bloody waters of the Styx. How I adore it, the delicious agony of it all. Mm. The other eight, well, they are pleasures unto themselves. Perhaps I'll show you myself, if I deem you worthy. So, the fourth level is uh, Stygia. I think the third level is Dis. The fifth level is Malbolge. Malbolge is the prison of the nine hells. Uh, I forgot the sixth, seventh, eighth level. Ninth level is the Nexus, or the Serpent's Coil, or the Bottomless Pit. That's Imodius' throat down there on the ninth layer, which is at the bottom. Um, I'm trying to remember what the second and third level is. Oh, yeah, third was this. That's where the Spader is, and the Glade Capital Sitter is this. I forgot what the second level is, though. Four is Frozen. That's where all the, like, Ice Devils and shit are. It's the fourth level. Uh, nope, I'm gonna leave. I don't care. All right, next I gotta talk to Gail. Gail, are you going to explode again? Now, wait, that's right. Never mind. He got his stuff under control. We must claim the crown of Carsus for ourselves before anyone else does. Dude, that's it. That's all you wanted to tell me, my guy. Jesus. Time and again, Will's plight reinforces my decision not to pursue the path of a warlock. It's one thing to make such a sacrifice in the pursuit of such a pact, but to do so in order to escape one. Truly, it leaves you with nothing. Eh, leave. Alright, is there anybody else I need to talk to? What's, what's, what's going on? Lysel. You got anything else new to say, or no? Chuck. The devil Mizor has made herself quite at home, hasn't she? Do make her feel as unwelcome as you can. Mmm, okay, leave. I'll talk about that stuff later. I just don't trust that she is who she says she is. I know it's not anybody in my party. It could be Jahira or Halson. But when I mentioned that Daniel to him, he knew exactly who that was. 
So that rules Halison out. Because <laughs> doppelgangers wouldn't have too much in-depth memories, I don't think. Yeah, let's go to bed. Wait, no. Talk to Carlac. Soldier? Hmm. Uh. Nope, leave. There you go. Alright, let's go. Auto select. There, don't pick the Albury egg. I've been meaning to sell that. Okay, there it is. Oh, rest. How did you? Oh, it's you. I must have let my mind wander. Enough for you to wander in. Forgive me. I am drained. Ever since you killed Catherick and took his netherstone, the Chosen's control of the brain has been... brittle. Its rebellion against Orin and Gortash has been fierce, even as it executes their final orders. Once those orders are complete, there is a good chance it will break free. You feel the Emperor's fear as if it were your own. An Elder Brain enslaved is one thing. An Elder Brain unleashed will be the end of everything. Beautiful, isn't it? The mighty Prince Orpheus, contained in submissive slumber. Come. You may as well sit a while, now that you are here. Your company isn't unwelcome. Hmm, what are you doing? You seem troubled. I expect you to be more on guard this close to the brain. Your company is disgusting. I expect you to be more on guard this close to the brain. You are correct. I should be. I'm haunted by memories. They are relentless. I can think of nothing. No one else. Who do you think of? Do you have a love interest? Not love, no. What I had with Belen Stelmain was much more than that. It was unique, at least when she was alive. You thought you were my first ally. Far from it. I have long sought the allyship of others. It is the only way to succeed, though my relationship with Berlin was different from my relationship with you. Was it more intimate? In a way, but not the way you're thinking of. In life, she was my business partner, back when we ran the Knights of the Shield. A difficult task for a mind flayer. Duke Stelmain trusted me, and the city trusted her. I conceived the plot, but Berlin took center stage. It was she who met with the merchants, politicians, and patriarchs. It was she who negotiated deals and signed off on agreements. Her rooms played host to the most important conversations in the city. Together, we brought order to chaos. At its height, everything that happened in that city went through the shield. Through us. I could not have done any of it without her. Just as I cannot do any of this without you. But now, she is gone. You need a hug. Sorry for your loss. I didn't know you were a mind player. I say you were upset. Mind flayers are soulless husks who feel nothing. 
Villain thought the same at first. You are wrong. Feeling is vital to the pursuit of anyone's goals, even the Mind Flayers. Like you, Mind Flayers know fear. Like you, we crave recognition. But unlike you, unlike the others of my kind, I am no slave to either. My end is and always has been freedom. Berlin understood this. Berlin became my freedom. Wait a minute. Hold on. I just thought about something. So... Wizards of the Coast owns D&D. &D, and later in the studios was contracted to make Alter's Gate 3. From Wizards of the Coast. Hmm. No, never mind. Never mind. Where I was going with that. Wizards of the Coast is owned by Hasbro. Hasbro is apparently contracted, not owned by, through Disney, to two certain toys for certain IPs. If Disney had owned Hasbro, which might be possible in the future, that would make the Emperor a Disney princess. But they don't at this time. But, fingers crossed, <laughs> fingers crossed that may or may not happen depending on which side of the fence you're on. I'm pro Emperor Disney Princess, but that's just me. <laughs> I mean, a story would be fitting. <laughs> Definitely. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, I know. Mind blown. Hot. There you go. Not working. I know what you are. Sorry, I was mean to you. That was insightful. I am glad you were able to learn something. Another quake. The brain is rebelling again. I need to focus. Yeah. Yeah, he does need to focus. I don't know if the Emperor can hold the control over the transformation process. If the um, Elder Brain becomes free. Wait, can I talk to people now? So I don't know who the fucking betrayer is. Watch to be this little kid. Hmm. Let me talk to Lazelle and do those extra options I keep ignoring. Voss is waiting beneath the city. We'll apprise him of our progress once we have the Orphic Hammer in hand. I didn't know about that. I didn't even tell you. Yeah, it could be a way to release Orpheus from this the room. Could it be? Yes. Yes. This is how we will free the Prince of the Comet. This is the key Voss so ardently and courageously sought. That smug shkaketh of a devil stores it at his vaunted house of hope. Our destination is clear. Our mission undeniable. We must find a way into the House of Hope and retrieve the hammer. When we next enter the Astral Prism, we will use it to smash Prince Orpheus out of his prison. Mother Gith, hear my promise. Your son will rise again. The Prince of the Comet will crush the Lich Queen Vlacketh and usher in the Age of Orpheus. Oh, that's it. Okay, leave. Um. All right, fine. Leave camp. So 
hi sorry i'm late happy friday no 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 you're fine just show up when you can hey, there's no time limit i just post so y'all know when i'm streaming it's fine come come as you are when you can i bear my arms open and in pure guidance to me and you shall rest your head upon my bosom when you are willing and ready to come. <laughs> right on, brethren. Crack me up. Uh, so what, what, what am I doing first here? Okay, so I gotta free them. I know the counselor is in prison as well. And I think something about some gnomes are imprisoned. I, I gotta deal with fucking what's his name too. Uh, God, it's already on. Okay. Jesus Christ, that's a lot of quest icons. Where's this map at? Fuck! Alright, what's what? What's what? What do we got here? One at a time. Okay. Murder target, Revere. Investigate murders. Talk to Gauntlet, Develop in the Elf Song Tavern. Murder target Cora. Murder target Frank. Speak with the bookseller and a sorcerer sundries. Speak uh, to Lordacon. Investigate Philiker's fireworks. Murder target Alexander. That's Casador's place. Find Zara's palace. Reach Casador's palace. Target Figaro. Murder target Nesha. Okay, it seems like this would be the best bet to go first. Gather your allies. Try to control our powers. We can trust that her magic will be there to help us when we need it most. We have children. We need to be able to fight. Okay. So down this way is Lower City against the waters. I need to go this way. Can I talk to any of these people? What the hell? There's a bunch Move of shit going along. on. I've got my hands full enough without gawkers. Uh, you turn up. You must agree, this is ludicrous. How are we meant to survive without our livelihoods? Your name's Turnip, Bobs. You just just sacrifice yourself. And it, it, it won't even be cannibalism. He'll just be eating a turnip. Region. Talk to the region. Still can't fathom that they hang folk in this city. Those gallows get more use than some temples. Every ten day, I write into the boulders' mouth about it, and every edition fails to mention it. Pathetic. Sometimes change has to come from the top. Um, here, let's go this way. What do we got over here? Is this a murder? I don't like this. I don't like the look in some of their eyes. Wait, who's this? Why is she on the ground? Citizen is unconscious. Won't be waking up anytime soon. What happened? These street trash need to watch their tone. I don't tolerate disrespect. If all these folks can just keep their shit together, maybe nobody else will get hurt. Maybe. Wait, did you attack this citizen? What happened here? Can y'all tell me what happened? 
one blow. One blow and she drops like she's dead. Well, maybe she is. Oh god, you people are just as useless as the fucking guards. Those things were gonna make me feel safe. Not anymore. I know, they'll turn on you. Hmm. Okay. Alright, who are you up here on this box talking all this nonsense? You two must submit to Lord Gortash if you are to be saved. What? He's not a savior. He's not some deity. The Steel Watchers are doing most of the good here, really. I'd love a gander at those schematics. You what you know? The fact that they have tadpole influence with mind trickery leads me to believe that the Still Watchers is not a mechanical entity. It's an exoskeleton, an exosuit. An exosuit with a body, possibly a corpse with a tadpole in it. Wait, can I not click on this guy? No. Okay. Wait, who's it? Is this? Yeah, let me go talk to her. So I can investigate these murders. Deal with wall. Ugh. Wait, hold on. Who's this? Talk to the guard. Watch yourself in there. Sarky bastards, these writer types. One five six, one five seven, one five. Oh, I'm um, sorry, count chat. One five six, one five seven, one five eight. Where was I up to? 156, 157, 158. Oh, thank her, Ellen. You're a lifesaver. 158, 159. The truth is the truth. Make up your own minds. What the hell is this? Is this a. Uh... Selena Frigg. What do you want, madam? Hey, cut it out, will you? I've got deliveries to manage. What? I just came up to say hi. Damn. I'll work, no play. Makes Jane a dull girl. Wait, is this a library? Since when do we need armed guards in a library? about you but them big metal bastards really put me off my flow needle well well if it isn't the city's next celebrity you star in our next edition's top story I might have to check in with my patron about that first. See how they feel about being in the spotlight. No, uh, seems odd. You've written the article before asking me any questions. Estra deals with the personal interviews and fluff pieces. I deal with the truth. And the truth is, you're a damned menace. Trafficking refugees into our city is hardly a good look. Especially when so many are absolutists and murderers. The truth will be out with tomorrow's broadsheet. People will spit in your face. Your very presence will be bad for business. You'll be a pariah, an outcast, as you should be. Wait, how did you find out? Um, we can only hope the fists do their duty and escort you to the gallows. Your days of scumming up this good city streets will be over. Deal. Hmm. Who 
told you this nonsense? Perhaps a bit of coin could make the article go away. If what you've said is the truth, pissing me off is a bad idea. Stop the article. Stop the article or I'll cook you from the inside. Actually, I kind of like the article. I kind of like this article, though. I mean, in a roundabout way, he's not wrong. Um, who told you this nonsense? I would never reveal my sources, and certainly not to the likes of you. Besides, you're too late. The headlines are loaded into the print works already. Tomorrow, you will feel the power of free speech. Vox Populi, Vox Dei. Now, guards! I believe our distinguished guest was just leaving. Would you care to escort them out? Let the guards take you outside. Attack the guards. Um. Let the guards take you outside. How the fuck am I supposed to talk to... Fuck, I gotta talk to what's her name? How? How do I... Oh... Stop the presses. No, I don't want to talk Will to Zara. his father to have freedom. Hmm. And understand, especially if the old duke's fall means his rise. Hmm. Guys are finding you out your back. I won't lie. The thought hardly fills me with uh, glee. Even with my newfound advantages, he's still an incredibly powerful vampire. But he's arrogant, too. If he does hear I'm back, he'll try to take me and expose himself in the process. Then I'll be able to strike. Mm, and how will you strike exactly? He won't be on. <laughs> Neither will I, darling. At least I hope you'll come along for the show. But regardless, the plan is simple. Find him, stop him from gaining almighty power, and then really enjoy killing him. <sighs> and if I can seize that almighty power for myself, well, all the better. Hmm. You must be thinking about it. The ritual. The thing that will decide my fate forevermore. Yes, it's been on my mind. Why? All that power? You must be tempted to take it for yourself. Well, of course I've thought about it. If I completed the ritual instead of Cazador, I'd get all that power. And I could walk in the sun without fear I'd turn into a mind flare. And naturally, who wouldn't be tempted? Of course, I don't even know if I could complete the ritual. It may be impossible, but it certainly is tempting. All right, leave. Cool. I need there. What? Step quick. I need you to go invisible. Do you have a scroll of invisibility? Items. He does not, do I? No one back home will ever believe this. Scroll of invisibility or potion.
Scroll of invisibility. How long does it last for? 10 turns? And vis a greater invisibility? Last for 10 turns as well. Alright, give me the regular ones. And the potions. And Viz. And the potions. How many potions? We got five. I'm going to give him two. Alright, there should be more than plenty for Hysterion to get in here. Potion of invisibility, take it. Simple. And bonus guidance, go. Nineteen. How the fuck do I miss that? Try again. Seventeen. What? The sarcasm. Yes, it's been on my mind. Try again. Yeah, I know. He's a... He's a bastard. 16! How am I rolling this low? My bonus is 13 to 16. That means I haven't rolled above a 7. Twenty-five. Jesus. Wait, where's my... Where's my invisibility? Are you fucking kidding me? So it's invisibility up until I do that, so... Here, take another potion of invisibility. Or right, take scroll. Come on, open the door. There you go. Alright, go. The softest touch. This way? Wait, how do I go to... Did I just break in for nothing? Stop the presses. Where do I go? It's there up against that wall. So it's to pull that switch once I get into there. Easy. Come on. In total, thirty. Continue. Unlocked. Okay. Cutting action high. I'm already hiding. Motherfucker. And he's got it. I'm afraid to intern. Shit. Let's move. Whatever it takes. Don't burn yourself. Ooh. Okay, it's back to Astaria. Sweet.
sweet. You just disappeared. Do you know how worried I was? Wait, hit the lever. Oh shit. Turn. Hit invisibility. Okay. Stepping softly. No, we'll go back to Astaria. We trust our readers to make up their own. What is this? Stop the presses. So it's it that way. What does? Okay, enter. He's down in the devil's den. They won't see me come. That's curious. Wait, how many turns do I have left? Five? Okay, cool. Hold on. It exited out of turn base mode? Jesus. Hold on. I could take a examine. Oh, he's got terrible perception. So it's not locked, so I can go ahead and step on in. Okay. There, cutting action. How about this? You approach the printer, noting its ink splots and intricate cogs. Before you can get closer, however, it begins to speak. Oi! Gormless! Over here! Thought I recognized you. Dolly 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 was right. You aren't much of a looker. Hmm. How do you know Dolly? Am I going mad or are you talking to a printer? Let me guess. Another Fay who needs freeing. I'm not trapped. You fool! This printing machine is just marvelous. We've nothing like it in the Feywild. This is my paintbrush. I make sure everything that's in those big, ugly article blocks becomes fine printed artistry. I'm a master pensman, I am. 
Dolly can't stop talking about you. <laughs> hero this, hero that, hero here, hero there. <laughs> Hello, hero. You know, there's some absolute filth about you in tomorrow's edition. <laughs> Seeing as you were kind enough to free Dolly, how's about I do you a favor? Why don't we change the headline? We can load up something a bit less damaging for your reputation. Yes, that's why I'm here. Hmm. Sounds good to me. Well, first, I've got to release the old nasty top story. Look there. <laughs> now, you've got to find a new article to replace it. Yeah, where can I find a set to print a new broadsheet? Listen, mate, I'm already doing you a favor. I'm sure you can figure it out yourself. As the old saying goes, ours is not to wonder why. Ours is but to print or die. Or something like that. Shit, now what? Oh wait, enter turn base. Fuck, how many turns I got left? Two? Okay, let me go close this door. Oof, okay, that was close. Now, exit turn base coming. I've only got one more scroll. Of it. The enter deal, because I was retarded. Get that. The annals of Boulder's Gate. Founding a book. Excuse me. Notice of termination. Fire without pay, effective immediately. Any further harassment of myself, our staff. While the mouth likes to nurture an atmosphere of open and honest debate with our newsroom, we draw the line at conspiracy, intimidation, and libelous behavior. You have become and are fostering a toxic, unjournalistic presence in the workplace. And while it brings me no joy, you've left us no choice. Tempt your resignation. You are fired without pay effective immediately. Hmm. Okay. Archduke's verification. Map. Is this... Auto printer manual. These are auto printers two steps. Loading your headline article, endless profit. Oh, okay. It's not funny. I don't care who keeps messing with the printer and adding mistakes to our additions. I'll duck all of your pay. If it doesn't, it doesn't cease immediately. Oh, that's the fae fucker with them. <laughs> that's actually pretty funny. Research report. Hmm. It is geography unsalvageable. High artificer. Versus ambiguity. Okay, whatever. 
a wolf in sheep's clothing. What is that? Yeah, pick up. Hold on. Encumbered? How am I encumbered? How much does that thing weigh? Four pounds. Sheesh. Oh, I could just move shit over and they're not even here? Alright, cool. Here, take this 20 bottles of water. There. Okay, cool. Certain earthquake shaking our homes. Eh. Here, I got it. Whatever it is I just picked up. I'm gonna read it. Oh, you've returned. Ready to serve some discount? Of course, absolutely. How delightful. Item? This piece. Wolves in sheep's clothing. Wait, no, this is... Hmm. Damn it. That's the one I he just spit out, right? Hold on. I gotta find another one because... What is this note to self? Oh, there's more stuff over here. Hmm. Google Gold Tour Cash has already outstripped any production records of manual printer set. Hmm. Oh, curse breaker or curse breakers? What is this? There we go. Put this one down here so I can read it. Terrible or Weasley words weave a terrible tale about you potentially. But they all say the same thing. What? Is this a bug? So... What? There's a backpack here. What's in the backpack? Is that a bug? Hold on. The Duke's mouth. Read. It nibbles on the council's ear in private audience chambers. It clings around our streets to steal automation, and it whispers sweet nothings from the pages of every brachi. The fetid pr presence of Lord Inverse Gortash is rotting our city, its very core. And this reporter is personally ashamed to work. Ah, I see. Yes, I will pick that up. That's the one I'll run. Here, let's run that one. Can I? Jesus. Okay, hold on. Let me look and see. Oh, you've returned. Ready to Absolutely. How delight. Alright, cool. Let's... I... Uh, was it this one? Notice the termination. Gate is closed. No, this one. The Duke's mouth. Invalid combination. Can I combine these? The hell? I mean, this that would be a great story to load up as that one right there. 
How can I do it? Hold on. Let me read this again. Printing is as easy as opening a hatch or placing in your desired article in the machine. Once the auto printer is loaded, it will be animate and begin pumping out copies until either the ink runs for or paper hopper is empty. Two endless profit. Where do I? What was this? Okay, what was this here again? Hold on. Because this is what... BG3 printing press. The quest guide. But this... I don't want spoilers. I'm just wondering why it won't let me fucking... Both those descriptions on this goddamn thing say the same thing. Tamper with the press as a complete to the stop press's quest. Save your rep. Uh okay, mouse slander, you need a newspaper at our needer, guess let's talk to him. Think his character solo. Now, what they talk about going through the roof? Um. And the wicker basket behind the press. Oh, what the fuck? So it has nothing to do with that shit. Either way. What's is in this trash bin? Adventure is our best hope for the city. Okay, thank all. <laughs> yep, yep, the absolutely. Our best hope for the city. Yes. That's what the people need to know. Now there goes all that inspiration I'm getting with no... I don't have any more scrolls of invisibility, do I? Now let's do an elixir of vigilance. Wait, which way does he turn when he gets to the end of the hall? So I've got to time it out with the other one as well.
Man, how do I not have any movement? Immobile, maimed. Shit. Shit, where was my last save? At the fucking campsite when I woke up. Oh fucking course. And I can't fucking move. That gets me there. Good, am I no longer maimed? Immobile? God damn it, how am I still fucking immobile for 10 turns? Fuck it, I've got to. Hold on. Then I can't get down there. God damn it. And I still can't fucking move. God damn it. Are you, are you fucking kidding me? All right, cool. No, not save game. Load game. We're going back to the fucking auto save at a goddamn camp. Can I get back to the back? Come on. Chris or a beer? Uh, have your own creative character? I thought you were saying intern, not intern. <laughs> so I'm silly. Yeah. Yeah, intern. Um, yeah, I do. Right now I'm using a stereo on. Uh, my creative character is up at the top. I've got the... Um, oh, God. What's the... It's a the, the, the overlay thing that you could look at for the characters and such. On the thingamajig for all my characters that I have, my builds and all the stuff there. I don't know how in depth it is because I haven't looked at it directly, but it's on there. Let's hope for gold. There we go. And that puts me overweight. Hold on. Move these 20 bottles of water to a character that's not even in the same room as me. There. Come over here. It's probably going to break my grater. So I have five turns left on it. And it ends. Oi! Gormless! Over here! Thought I recognized you. Hmm. Let me guess. Another fae who needs free. I'm not trapped. This. You know, why don't we change the headline? We can load up something a bit less damaging for your reputation. Yeah. Sounds good to me. first... I've got to release the old nasty touch. Have an article? Let's get started. How delightful. Okay, cool. And I still have my invisibility. That is nice. Our best hope for the city. That's what the people need to know. Oh, wait, enter turn base. Hold on, shit. I got one more turn of greater. Oh, God, that took all that out of me. Shit, would it be faster to go that way? Fuck, here, let me in turn. Yeah, okay, so... I lost my invisibility. Uh, that isn't working for me for every damn bag. 
of linked holding. Look at him. Okay, hold on. Here's the overlay. Where's it at? Yeah, it should pop up on the left hand side there. What does it got? No, that's full screen on Twitch. I don't need that. Hold on. The extension has not received any game data? Wait, what? Twitch integration. It's enabled in game. What? Members quest progress, blah blah blah. Enable Twitch integration in the in game settings. It's. Wait, did it turn it off when I update it? Twitch integration. No, it's checked. What the hell? Why is it not working? Okay, well, I am a Sorlock. Sorlock, getting that whole thing in there. Wait, I need bonus action. I need my potions. My invisibility. Yeah, this should be fine. I got another scroll of greater, though, right? Hold on. Yes, I do. Use it. Alright, cool. Can I move now? Let's be quick. Wait, no. I need you to shift. Like, stealth. Because you are a pain in the ass. Go over this way. Yeah, extreme Eldritch Blast. Yeah. Oh, Lord. All right, enter. Now, that's a special thing where he's the only character that can sneak into the printing press here. Well, only still the character I have. I th Wait, it's not? I thought it was. There's a way to possibly get it. Uh, through a mod. There's a mod out there that rearranges the entire game to work exactly like 5th edition. And it has all the additional 5th edition spells that weren't included and the 5th edition classes and subclasses. They've also got all the 5th edition races that weren't included and a whole bunch of other shit that you can add. It's like a whole mod suite. It adds everything. Actual 5th edition even changed the rules to work for 5th edition in Baldur's Gate 3. I'm not running ads because I want achievements or ads uh, mods because I want achievements. After that though, it's fair game. At least for my first playthrough. Um... Yeah, here. Bonus action. Bring that. Here, run over here. We're gonna run right around this guy. This way. Oh, nope. Here. Another dash. And enter. Hold on. This guy. Uh, I have my D and D character, who is Blade Singer, and skates on a huge ass giant sword and does skateboard shit before launching it with a catapult. Nice, very nice. Can I get over here? No, I can't. Here, I'm not going to be able to do anything this round anyways. Use my extra movement to get there. Then in turn, I'm pretty much scot-free until I get back up top. Then once I get back with the group, I can rejoin and everything's gravy. Alright, there. Whatever. They have not even taken the time to close that goddamn door. Alright, get outside. Alright, close the door behind you. Because we're not animals. And then run right here. Matter of fact, just do that. One group. There. Alright, we're going to exit turn based combat. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right, now I gotta go talk to the investigator over here. Eh, that'll be nice. Oh. Hmm. 
things are still there. Visit it. Oh, the Emperor's old house. Oh, this must be it then. Okay. Um, I'm surprised. Uh, Chris, uh, you ain't streaming tonight. It'd be on Friday and all, you know. Not sure what you would be frame, yeah, streaming, but yeah. Uh. Anti-hack support group poster. What? Cursed to put my hands on everything. I was working, but our system went down. Oh, so you like jump on Twitch, see who I can watch. <laughs> gotcha, big guy. <laughs> when the system's down, support your friends. Hold on, let me grab a beer. Ooh. Wait, hold on. I just slapped my mic, everything. Uh, scoot back. Oh, with Tekken? Uh, yeah. You didn't even leave. Hold on for what? You ain't over to the left to get out of a drink. Hold on my ass. You slapping us now? No, I'm slapping the mic, not chat. Hold on my ass. Yeah, I got I got a mini fridge like right here by my setup, so it's all cool. It's all good. It's all gravy. Coolest mini fridge ever. Got it for free. I was throwing stuff away at the dumpster at the apartments I was last at, and this guy was throwing stuff away, and he's like, hey man, I'm moving out. Do you want a free mini fridge? I was like, hell yeah. <laughs> so I got a free mini fridge. It works perfectly fine, too. I've been holding beer in it and random uh, drinks and soda. A plus. Everything just falls into place. Tension, have you been hexed by a hack? Who lost a loved one to a deal? You're not alone. Join other survivors of hack trickery at Baron's Coop. Alone, we're vulnerable, but together we can stand up against hacks. True. Lucky ass. Yeah, I know, right? You can get a decent... Well, let me rephrase this. A few years ago, you can get a decent one for about 60, 80 bucks, depending on where you go. Now, I'm not so sure. I think it might be double that. So, you might get a decent one for about 100, 120. So, roughly. Uh, a little more vulnerable, but together we can stand up against hags. Yeah. I think that might be Walmart-ish. Help the hag survivors. Okay. Yeah, this there's so much stuff going on. Hold on. Can I walk in here? <sighs> Yay, there's like people everywhere. Patron, patron. Oh, this is a bar. Alright, who am I supposed to be talking to? The investigator who is in here. Do I need- do I recognize anybody in this place? Hey, there's Lucrissa! Are the other tieflings here? Hold on, Lucrissa! She owes me 10 gold. Well, well, look what the bugbear dragged in. Can't believe we both made it to the city, and with our limbs attached. And you owe me 10 gold. Cost me a fair amount of supplies, too. Got anything to trade? Busy stealing for, from the Elf Song, are you? Never picture you as a barmaid. Did we make a bread in the Jew a bat in the Jewish Grove? I didn't think you survived, yet here you are. Wait, that was the bet? I was betting for her survival. We did, didn't we? Never thought I'd begrudge being alive. Oh, that's Alas, what I thought. I've got nothing in my pockets but lint and disappointment. No. Uh, how about a kiss there? Carlex right here. She's right here. That's my woman. Okay, fine. <laughs> Is that the fire dummy on me? Zoom the camera over to the big dummy. Yeah, that's her right there. I can't zoom right here and I got in talking though. Scam, scam. I know, right? Please, I will hear it. Just a second. But yeah, Carlac, she's a. Uh, I can't. I can't just kiss you. She's my lady. She's. She's my maiden. You still have to pay up. Perhaps I can help you with that. I'd like to trade. Fine. What she got? She got nothing. Ah. 
I can't even trade with her. Fuck. Times of hitter are hard. What? Boom. Ha. <laughs> that was... This is win game of the year with cutscenes like this. This is bullshit. It's not a cutscene. It's talking like communication is not even a cutscene. Cutscenes are different, but fine. If it makes you feel any better, there she's like right here. Okay, you you get better cutscenes later. Hmm. Ears on. Wait, what do you have? <laughs> it's a cutscene in game cutscene. Okay. Gortash, an archduke. Mm. However, did they find a crown big enough for his head? The more correct term is animated event. Don't get sassy with me. <laughs> animated event. Not a cutscene. Animated event. Okay, hold on. So that was her. What, what does she want? You, you oh, sassy you bitch. <laughs> Lord Gortash is I a take it. Young I take whatever I can get. Think? Not that anyone cares what you think, or me for that matter. What? Whatever. Backpack, backpack, empty plate, backpack. Neverwinter stew. Rub sack. Surrender your burdens. Who is this? Ulrich with um Kisaram Bombasto Bombasto <laughs> I sure would want to be one of the flaming fists. They got the shittiest job in town. Believe me, I know something about knocking heads together. Wait, hold on, my guy. I know a Chris that we called Red Beer. You live in Columbus, Chris? Uh, I would highly recommend y'all start messaging each other on this topic. Not right in the middle of my chat. There's probably other people I can hear. So, for personal reasons, I would say message each other just in case. But yeah, they just did a whole animated event for him to stand up and tell me that one sentence and then jump back down. You gonna dox me? I'm not. I'm just saying. You don't know who the fuck's in my chat. Shit, there's lurkers everywhere. I'm just saying. Do it for your own personal privacy. Don't, don't, don't mind me. I don't care. I know who Chris is. I know partially who Jabon is by extension of someone else. I will. Get out of here. Get the hell out of here. Oh, God. Okay. From one warrior to another, I must say, it's just embarrassing the way the flaming fist lets this murderer go around killing people and getting away with it. How are you called Big Red, though? You're not even that big. You're about average size. Is it just because you had big, poofy red hair? Hey! <laughs> ah, what are you I must say. It's just embarrassing. He's playing the unless this murderer girl. Go around and kill if you want to get away with it. Yeah, big, poofy red hair didn't help. Eh! When I met you, you weren't fat. You just average size to me, so. Uh, You don't think the fists are up to this ass? Fists are only good for handling riots. Investigations is their strong suit. You don't need subtlety to sort these matters out, just persistence. That's what I told Commander Portier anyway. Hmm. How would you deal with it? What did the first commander have to say to that? Commander Portier says she already has some investigator she trusts. Soft talking namby pambies, I'd wager. But when they fail, and they will, count on it. She knows where to find Dame Gizarm. Then it'll be my turn. Alright, who's this guy over here? Hello, 
old friend. Oh, so I assume. I, I used to know everybody around town. But now I'm a new man. Who the fuck are you? A new man? Who were you when you were an old man? A worried <laughs> man, a playwright who lost the will to write. <laughs> now I worry no more. Can't write a word? What does it matter? Mm -mm. You talk about the honor of your order, but what about my honor? I made a deal. Stog, if you want to join the Vigilant Knights, you have to quit beating people up. Settle down, you two. People are trying to drink here. What's this about? Someone need to get beaten up? I can handle that. <laughs> I'm supposed to bust up this guy what owes money to Uktar of the Guild, but Gerva says if I want to join her order, that's a no-go. But I already took the money for it from Uktar, so I gotta follow through. It's like an oath or something. Yeah, I get and that. I know you understand oaths, Gerva. What am I going to tell the Vigilant Knights, Doug? That you're knee-breaking for goodness? Hmm, if he wants to join an order of Helm... It sounds to me, Stug has to give up knee breaking effective immediately. If Stug's already been paid for the task, he has to follow through on it. Tell you what, Stug, give me the money, put a car paid for the job, paid you for the job, and then you're off the hook. Yeah, cool. Fair Helms deal, deal. Days, you sound like a guild lawyer. You must think I'm pretty dumb. And maybe I am. Because I'm going back to return Oktar's money. Don't wait up, Gerva. Might take me a and while to crawl back home with two busted knees. But and honestly, I like the nickname after the first couple months. It's stuck. And if you talk about the big red, it was about this goofy fuck who said dumb shit. Okay, what the hell happened? Your character's left. Uh, look, okay, so come on, did it glitch out? I don't know. I looked away. No, it's her left eye and her right eye. Um. There's a special bonus you can get from Volo, which is the same author of Volo's Guide to Monsters. Um, in the actual 5th edition books, that same Volo. Uh, he performs surgery on your eye to remove the, you know, the tadpole. No, oh, the uh, Beholder of Xanathar. Volo's the, the bar that goes around and writes stories and books about all the creatures of the Faerun. Yeah, yeah, so he, he tries to help you out with the tadpole. And he ends up sticking an, um, a long, like, pick in your eye. And then he uses an ice pick right after that, which is bigger. And he ends up screwing your eye up. But he gives you a magical eye that allows you to see invisibility. And that's the effect of the eye. Yeah, he is a nerd. He didn't know a damn thing he was doing, though, when he helped me out. But he gave me a cool eye. That I can permanently see invisibility with, so I guess that's good. Okay, so that was pointless. They're all pointless. Who are you? Are you pointless? Just between us, I don't believe everything I hear from Director. Sorry, Archduke Gortash. He's entirely too slick to be trustworthy. You are correct. That is sick, to be honest. Yeah. The whole the scene, though, is funny, though. Watches. At least the big teapots don't make lewd suggestions when you pass by. They smell better, too. Oh. What are all these people here? I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Hold on. As far as I'm concerned, Lord Gortash gets the benefit of the doubt. Until he does something obviously wrong, he's got my support. We can't afford to be squabbling with the absolute crawling up our asses. Problem is, by the time he fucks up, it'll be too late. Buff, Buff Tanner. I've been thinking about it. He's I Buff feel Tanner. bad about all them refugees, but we just can't let them flood into the city. We'd be overwhelmed. In fact, the 
That's probably the absolute army's plan. Cause fuck that, man. I wouldn't need the ability to swap classes. Too many cutscenes. <laughs> right. Okay, look, I'm tired of talking to all these random nobodies. Um Where do I need I need to go here? Rover. <sighs> That's right, he's one of the murder targets. Damn rat. Oi, you! I thought I asked you to clean the rats out of this cellar yesterday already. Hop to it! Get in there! Uh... Hold on. Wait, to be honest, this is the most I've seen of the game so far. And I gotta say, I appreciate the fact that they don't cycle through the same four animations Bioware does with Mass Effect and Dragon Age. Right? They actually went through and did their stuff. If you want more of their stuff, like Larian Studios, Divinity. Original Sin and Original Sin 2. Both of them are great. They're the uh, precursors to this game here. From their studio, what they've done. Their own original story and IP. It's actually why they were contacted to do Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, was because of those first two games that they did. Your list is on the name and where to target. You need to hide. No, I need them rats taken care of. Here's the deal. I'll keep a lookout for murderers. You murder the rats. Oh, is this a... <gasps> is this a callback to the first Baldur's Gate or Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance? I remember being in here and you had to go down into the cellars and kill the rats. He still has a rat problem all these years later. What the hell? So I guess I gotta go downstairs or upstairs to get to the murder investigation. Hold on. That is neat as fuck. Uh, I like to play Baldur's Gate 2 uh, where you can level up two different classes at, uh, at the 20. Yeah. I mean, I haven't I haven't played. I played Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance, but I don't think I played Baldur's Gate 1 and 2 too much. I played Dark Alliance, mostly. That's because it was on GameCube. That's where I played it at. <laughs> Tavern basement. Kill the rats. Murder target. Where's the... Where's the investigator? That's the hag. Where's the investigator? Quest. Investigate the murders. Rover storehouse, stop the presses. Visit the Emperor's old hi hideout. Deal with the gnomes, hack survivors. Where is it at? Hold on. Play some DNA game like this on PC way back in the day. I do not remember the name of it. It was my first PC game. And I died to a sheep that transformed into a demon, I think. That might be like Baldur's Gate 1 or 2 back in the day. I'd be able to stop down isometric like this here. Um, wait, where's the fucking quest at? For investigating the murders, for talking to. Talk to Gauntlet Devella in the Elf Song Tavern. Yeah, where's she at? Where's the Vela? Hold on. I have a feeling that once I go down here, he's gonna fucking say something. He's gonna, when I come back up, this guy's gonna be dead. It was. Uh, I ain't too sure. I gotcha. Some chef he is. <laughs> Alright, fine. I'm gonna go downstairs. Take care of these damn rats. Hold on. 
No. The cellars are just down the stairs. There, you'll find my old lodgings. Talk to the cat. Wait, no, I don't have... Meow, meow. Hold on. Give me... Type. Potion. Nope, that's option. I need potion. Potion of mind reading. No, not arrows. What the hell? Where do you even get arrows from with a potion? There. Potion. Mind reading. What the? Hold on. Hold on, just hand me there. Potion of mind reading and then potion of animal speaking. There. That's fine. Do you got an elixir for me? Kill giant shrink there. Bark scan. Go off of movement. See invisibility. They'll need it. Chronic resistance there. Ultra resistance. Viciousness. Accuracy. Oil bane. Jellic. Flying. Do I not have any other elixirs? Yeah, sure. Let's do viciousness. Then consider it yours, No, I want to talk to the cat. Give me cat. There. From both of us. Look, tambourine. What subclass are you? Uh, for Warlock, I am Fiend. Which I think I might switch up. And then for... the other servants will feed us. And then for a sorcerer, I am Draconic, I don't like which I did fire, so that's redundant. So I think I might switch that up to to a different dragon type, so I get an additional resistance to a different effect. Uh, what do you got, Tambourine? Should have went Hexblade to get three sword attacks. I'm not melee, so I just completely skip out of that. Their presence vexes me. Oh god, even the cats want me to kill the uh, damn rodents. Wait, how many rats are there? Examine. I can see 11. They only have one hit point. Wait, the cats? Yeah, the cats wanted me to kill the rats as well. Yeah, they're apparently they're lazy. They asked me that they just asked me to kill them as well. Okay, cool. Here, kill all those. How do you miss? It's reckless. There, you're a barbarian. Get them. Cool. Now you come up here, attack this one. Did you not pop? Hold on. God damn it! I didn't pop that potion. With that elixir. Here, another greater weapon. Come up here. Do that. That's fine. Go over here. There to Garfield's at the bottom <laughs> of uh, Baldur's Gate. I've made two characters, Tempest Cleric and a Storm Sorcerer. Uh, combine those. Two, letter two levels of Tempest Cleric and then go up to level uh, six or level level four Storm Cleric or Storm Sorcerer. And then you can decide if you want to do four more levels of cleric and then finish out rest sorcerer or just leave it at two levels of cleric and do the rest sorcerer and make sure everything's wet and you just you can like bomb everything with lightning damage I'm ready. i've got an alt character i'm doing uh uh tempest storm cleric sorcerer crossover all right, cool. Hold on. Here, sneak attack this rat. All right, cool. Then there. No, is there? You have to bite a rat. There you go. Are you happy? He is not happy for biting a rat. Of course. Not. 
Okay, you can come over here and attack the rat too. Attack that rat. Uh, and fighter hexblade warlock. Do you have exploding barrels? Throw it down here, there, and shoot it. Break the PC. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Actually, I do have exploding barrels on Carlac. <laughs> but I don't. I don't want to do that. That's fine. Group up. Group up. There you go. Group up. Okay. AoE. Do I have AoE here? Just use one of these. No. Back out. Hold on. I don't really have much AoE on her. I don't. I've got Thunder Wave. Huh. That's fine. Here, run up here. Run over here. Then we're gonna thunder wave this way. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, there is an explosive barrel right there. I don't know what it does, but yeah. That's fine. Alright, fine. Intern. And then you can... Can I fireball? Shatter. That is second level. Can I use a warlock spell slot? No, I can't. I can do burning hands though. Here. Burn over here. Use burning hands. That way. Huh? No. That's fine. Uh, black hole. Heh. <laughs> Check. Uh, let me go ahead and get this started here. Was, um, on this here. Yeah, do that over there. Cool. Alright, enter. Oh no, rats, what are you doing? Shield blow. Kill that rat. Oh no! I'm just killing him left and right. I don't even know what's killing him. Here, attack that. Reckless, of course. There we go. Done. Into him. Slaughter. Can you attack that? <laughs> then attack that. Wait, no. Whatever, Syria. I don't even care anymore. What? How do, how do the imp miss? The imp's like the same si shield. No, don't react. It's just a goddamn rat. What? No, I'm not wasting my long rest reaction for that. No. Alright, you, Shadowheart, what are you doing? Mm, excuse me. No. No, no AoE. No AoE. I got a throw level spell. I'm not gonna waste it here. Just attack. Attack that thing. Like the only time you can actually hit something. Alright, cool, because you're worthless otherwise. Alright, cool. Um, shatter? Is this what we've come to? Bye. Uh, and. Boom. There. Nope. Nope, no reaction. Go. Fuck them rats. Um... No, not that. Uh, do I need to... Can I do something else real quick? <laughs> Repulsor, that'll fuck everybody over. Stage Fright, Mind Blast there. Nah. 
Seems like a waste. Hold on. Yes. You. Make sure this rat cannot do wisdom checks. Go. There, come over here and just kill these motherfuckers, because they're done for. They're dead. You it. There. Done. <sighs> Rats be dead. Keepsake ring? The hell? Was that on a rat? Might be useful. Chopped up pig, pig's head, pig's shoulder, pig, pig loin. Over by the wine racks. What wine racks? Hell. On the other side, you'll find a passageway known only to those invited to do business. I'll give it a shot. What path lies before me? All of them. Okay. What is this? Wait, where am I at? Hold on. Okay. Oh, there's the button. Something over there. Of course, a whole giant keg in the wall hitting door trope. Sonic detector's been activated. There must be Gith hostiles nearby. Cool. Bring it on. doesn't come, we must find evidence of its whereabouts. Who is that? Gatemaster Silrek. Who is that up there in the gate? What are you doing? Sir, get out of the gate. Who is that? Veteran Gesh. What? How many hit points does she have? 31? 